Hello, and this is Sunny. Welcome back. Today, my topic is TCP and UDP. TCP and UDP are two protocols at the transport layer of the OSI model. TCP stands for Transmission Control Protocol, and UDP stands for User Datagram Protocol. Let's look at their difference first. Reliability. TCP is a reliable transmission protocol, while UDP is not. When TCP delivers data segments to its destination, the protocol makes sure that each segment is received, no error occurs, and all segments are put together in the correct order. On the other hand, when UDP delivers data to its destination, it does not guarantee, or even not care, if the data reaches the destination. Once the data is sent off, goodbye and good luck. Therefore, UDP is not reliable. The second difference is TCP is connection-oriented, while UDP is connectionless. Let me explain why. TCP uses a three-way handshake to make sure the connection is established before data transmission. After data is delivered, TCP will follow a four-step procedure to make sure every bit of data is delivered and received before closing the connection. On the other hand, UDP is connectionless. No handshake to establish the connection, no procedure to close the connection. There's no way to know if the data is received. Once data is taken off, no string attached. TCP is like a formal interview, while UDP is like shouting at someone in a sports arena. You don't really care about. If the person hears you or not, here are some jokes about TCP and UDP. A TCP walks to a bar and says, "I want a beer." The bartender says, "You want a beer?" TCP replies, "Yes, I want a beer." A UDP walks to a bar and says, "I want a beer." He really doesn't care if the bartender hears him or not. He might never get a beer. Well, he's UDP. He doesn't care. I have been married for 26 years. For the first five years, communications between my wife and me is like TCP. I talked and she listened. She talked and I listened. But in the past several years, our communications were becoming more like UDP. I shouted to her, and she shouted to me. But I guarantee that neither of us listened. Well, the only listeners are our neighbors. If I were TCP, I would ask you about my joke. Did you get it? Did you get it? Did you get it? Until you said yes. If I were UDP, I would not even bother you with this stupid question. Did you get it? Did you get it? Finally, let's look at the TCP header and UDP header. Here, I do not want to go to detail to bore you to death. You can easily see the difference. I simply want to point out that even though UDP has checksum two, but is optional for IP version four, and it's only required for IP version six, and is much simpler than that of TCP. At this point, you might ask, is there any good things about UDP? Yes, UDP is faster and more efficient than TCP. UDP is useful for live streaming audio or streaming video. When we watch、uh, movies online, yes, we care about reliability, but we do not want to delay. 
UDP is also good for multicast and broadcast, uh, such as DNS queries or DHCP broadcast or voice over IP. But only a few applications use UDP. TCP is still the dominant transport protocol. Web browsing, telnet, FTP, and email are using TCP. Thank you very much, and see you next time.